Hello everyone, Technosuth Craig Chamberlain here. We are on episode 2 of the Faster Vista series where we show you how to speed up your Windows Vista operating system. Now this episode is going to go pretty quick. Just scroll down to the bottom left hand corner and click on your start button. Type in msconfig, which brings up your msconfig. Right click on it, click run as administrator. This is going to bring up your system configuration utility and what we're interested in today is your startup. So go ahead and drag it to the left a little bit and on the right hand side as you'll see I open up my browser and I open it up to Google. Now there's really only one really good way to do this with your startup. Essentially these are all the things that are starting up on your Windows startup. Now technically you could disable all of these things and uh, apply it and walk away from it but typically that's not recommended some of these services really you should have running right when you start up your computer so what you really need to do is is you actually need to scroll on the command section scroll it and expand it to the right hand side and you have these executables and also the uh, what the actual DLL files are uh, and what you need to do is Google these because it's really the only good way to do it uh, of course on the left hand side if there's something that you know you don't need on boot up it will start up manually when you actually open the software so it's not like disabling these will actually destroy your software or make your software not work at all it'll just uh, make it start up slower or you might need to go through your start menu to actually get what program you need so as an example we're gonna go ahead and do the uh, real tech voice manager skytel.exe so let me go ahead and type that into google skytel.exe it says uh, processlibrary.com what is skytel.exe that's a good one so we'll go ahead and select that and then we have description it's a real tech voice manager uh, from semiconductor corp and it said it should not be disabled required for essential applications to work properly so obviously I don't want to disable that one and uh, you really should do this with pretty much all the processes I know it's gonna seem like a tedious job at first because you'll probably have a lot of these on your list uh, but what the nice thing is is you're gonna actually learn which ones you do need to run and which ones you don't and then it's pretty much streamlined after that once you've learned what you need and what you don't uh, but that's all there is to this episode. This will actually increase your uh, Windows Vista startup time, uh, probably pretty significantly for those of you who have a lot of stuff installed and haven't done this before. Uh, but go ahead and leave comments and ratings, and don't forget to subscribe. As always, thanks for stopping by, and don't forget to swing by the website.